Hello everyone and welcome to today's episode of The Drawing Board. My name is David Franklin, I'm your host, and thank you for joining us for our 30 Day Tesseract Dice YouTube series, where for 30 days we're talking about the science behind our Tesseract Dice on YouTube. And today we're gonna to be talking about Nikola Tesla and his Tesla coil, but not just that, but Nikola Tesla's greatest inventions of all time. Now the Tesla coil is probably one of the most memorable inventions Tesla has ever developed because it was so phenomenal and generated lightning from it, but it wasn't exactly the most useful thing our society had. The Tesla coil was sort of like a stepping stone. It allowed Tesla to experiment with transferring lightning or immense amounts of electricity from one metal surface to another. And Nikola Tesla absolutely loved energy and electricity, which is why his number one invention slash development of all time was alternating current. Technically, he didn't invent alternating current. It was already a theory, but what he did was to bring that technology to engines and to houses and to things that we plug into the wall like TVs. He also developed fluorescent lights which charge plasma inside of tubes, which are kind of like our modern, more efficient CFLs or compact fluorescent lights. Not like Edison's tungsten light, which lit a filament on fire inside of a vacuum, which again is a reason why a lot of people like to say that he was a better inventor than Edison. He also developed x-rays, which have led to numerous advancements in the medical field and in engineering. And he invented the radio, communicating with two different light frequencies over a distance. Radio is named after radio waves or a form of light radiation that we can't see. However, Tesla found a way to use this form of light radiation to be able to communicate over long distances, which is how he developed the radio. He also developed the electric motor, which he basically invented on a dare from Edison, who dared him to even try to make a motor that used alternating current. Eventually, he was honored by the Tesla Car Company, which is an all-electric car company that uses alternating current, just like most cars, but they're all electric in honor of him. He also developed basic robotics. His idea was that humans were basically just really, really advanced combinations of muscle and of sinew and of electrical impulses in our brain. And not that we're anywhere close to developing robots that advanced, but he did prove that he could make basic robots do basic things that we do. He also developed the laser, another form of charged plasma. And in his work with both radio and energy, he developed wireless communication like the radio and free energy at the same time. He had a theory that towers would utilize radiation and solar energy and other forms of energy in the world and transmit it to people for free. Which is just another reason why a lot of people consider Nikola Tesla to be a greater inventor and even a better person than Thomas Edison. Thomas Edison was also a terrible husband and a lackluster father at most points during his life, and he did most things for profit. But in Edison's defense, working for profit in itself doesn't necessarily make you a bad person, and Nikola Tesla never actually officially produced towers that gave out free energy. It was just a theory that power giants at the time sort of discouraged him from doing because it would take their money away. Whether or not it would have happened, I don't know. But Nikola Tesla did have 10 of the greatest inventions of all time. Thank you so much for watching today's episode of The Drawing Board. My name is David Franklin, your host. Thank you for joining us for a 30-day science series for our Tesseract Dice campaign on Kickstarter. And if you wanna see more about the dice, you can check out our Kickstarter link in the description below. And if you just wanna follow along for the rest of our 30-day campaign, learn some science, talk some science, talk about some cool things, you can hit the subscribe buttons, the blue button in one of those corners over there. And make sure to join us tomorrow when we're gonna be talking about the solar system as it was foreseen by Galileo Galilei, great scientist, mathematician, and inventor. See you guys then.